Hi, meteorologist Mike Brookins with the forecast on this Monday night. A very forgettable start to the work in school week. After seeing some sunshine yesterday, the clouds were back in full force for Syracuse at least today. I know if you went south of Onondaga County, skies were brighter. Plenty of sunshine down in south near Ithaca, south of Cortland, Shenango County as well. Temperatures were a little bit warmer in the Finger Lakes with that sunshine. 44 the high on this Monday in Penyan, 41 in Syracuse with mid-30s up in the Saranac Lake. Here's what we can expect looking ahead. Clouds, areas of fog and light drizzle during the overnight. And with the temperature going below freezing, there's also the potential for some light freezing drizzle or even a flurry. Much of the time, in most places, it'll be dry. More promising chance for sunshine to develop Tuesday afternoon. Partly sunny and not as cool. Still dry Wednesday during the day, but Wednesday night that could change. So here's the future cast. Notice, gray skies, clouds over most of the region, most of the night. And there's not a lot of precipitation. That odd light flurry, light drizzle area, or freezing drizzle. Going into the start of the day Tuesday, that persists. Now the winds start to pick up out of the southeast early in the day. This should shoot this light precipitation up closer to Lake Ontario early in the day, and eventually the clouds should mix out. But boy, it's going to be stubborn and a slow process. Don't expect much sunshine in the morning, at least, for Syracuse. More promising, 2, 3, 4 o'clock for a mixture of sunshine and clouds. Tuesday night, mainly clear to partly cloudy, becoming mostly cloudy, and then Wednesday, some partial sunshine. So your forecast hour by hour this evening, at least early on, most spots are dry, but we'll get in that spotty light drizzle and going in through the later night hours as it turns colder, that's where we could encounter some light freezing drizzle or even patchy fog with freezing fog. Winds turn nearly calm, and while it does cool down to chilly levels by late night at 28, that's still two degrees above average and not as cold as last night's mid-20s. Temperatures to start the day, near or below freezing, still that patchy light drizzle or freezing drizzle or a flurry, especially up near Lake Ontario to the north early in the day. Otherwise, clouds in control for the early day, towards midday, some breaks of sun, more in the way of sunshine there, late day with a high temperature getting up to 42. Above normal temperatures continue right on through the seven-day forecast. 49 on Wednesday, dry during the day with partial sunshine. A few light showers develop in the evening. A few showers in the morning and midday, Thursday. By late day, it turns partly sunny. 54. How about 56 and partly sunny, pleasant on Friday? There could be a shower or two as a warm front moves through, boosting our temperature to 61 on Saturday with dry conditions. It's still rather mild on Sunday. We'll be in the upper 50s on Sunday with a few showers possible. Better chance for some scattered showers as a cold front approaches on Monday. There's your latest seven-day forecast. Have a good night.